also this like bubble wrap fully destroyed, absolutely compressed and smashed. Uh, been shipped overseas. Okay, and now we get another wrap. Also feels like a bob another bubble wrap inside. Yeah, and another full bubble wrap inside. And like really it's you guys could not like just wrap it with this one drive in some piece of paper so it will not like ring around it. Alright, we'll see. So the condition Well, this doesn't look good. Maybe functional. But that's what kind of damage happens if you Don't package your items properly. Yeah, this looks. Yeah, it looks this. This, this not good, guys. You just like destroying like a shipped item. Why? Well, I can tell it's not functional, sort of cannot work, but like I am planning to set it on a telescope mount. This kind of a let's see, put some light onto it. This is better. Focus. All right, so this is a gear. How is it true to size? Fifty two base. I would say sixty two. That's right. Is the whole diameter ninety three? And here is the warm condition. And those are for bearings six and six and uh, hold on a second. So 
So this and this supposed to help hold some bearings like 6 by 10 millimeters should fit nicely. And over here you put your this one is 5. Over here you put your actual fully for GT time. GT2 timing belt, twister promoter, or anything like that. So, okay, that's the first kit. Let's see how the second survived. So, whichever is better shape will serve as RA, right ascension, and whatever is worse will serve as deck because deck does not move when when tracking our skies right I'm talking about telescope mount so well I guess let's look Okay, another one notch over here. Uh, another seven notch over here. Another over here. Well, another over here. Yeah, I guess this one slightly worse. Well, this. Well, this has a one large inch, not sure it fit, it, it may impact anything, something, but yeah, I guess I will go with this one for RA. Should be more or less okay. Well, stay tuned, thank you.